After a dispute with Nicole Kidman on the red carpet, Salma Hayek wrote a cryptic message applauding women in Hollywood who uplift one another. The two actors appeared to get into a heated argument at the Balenciaga presentation during Paris Fashion Week last month. A video of the violent incident went viral recently, prompting a barrage of questions from people on social media about what had happened. Amidst the conjecture on the internet, Salma, 58, shared an endearing ode to the community of individuals who had continuously uplifted her. In recognition of National Hispanic Heritage Month, the mother of one, who was born in Mexico, shared a variety of pictures in which she was pictured posing with different Hispanic celebrities. She captioned it, saying, Happy for the supportive community that surrounds me, consistently elevating our culture, amplifying our voices, and advocating for change. We honor our heritage together. Salma posted photos of herself with several celebrities, including actresses Jenna Ortega, Penelope Cruz, Sofia Vergara, Jessica Alba, Eva Mendez, Zoe Saldana, and Isa Gonzalez. She also featured photos of herself with singer Selena Gomez and pop star Becky G. It happened barely two weeks after she and Nicole, 57, appeared to get into a fight. When the two women started fighting, they were standing in front of photographers with 39-year-old Katy Perry. The Frida alumna, whose fashion millionaire husband Francois Henri Pinot owns Balenciaga, appeared to be at odds with Nicole over the brand ambassador's refusal to look in front of the cameras. Salma attempted to shift the Australian actress' body towards the press by placing her hand on her shoulder, but Nicole didn't seem to be having any of it and swatted Salma's hand away. Then, according to one witness, Nicole sternly ordered Salma, Don't touch me. Nicole then turned back to Salma and exchanged a few more harsh words before striking up a conversation with Katie and planting a kiss on her cheek. The blonde beauty seemed to give the single mother a stop sign with her hand and pointer finger before finally leaving. Judy James, a body language specialist, later stated that she thought the embarrassing altercation was just a matter of etiquette. She said, The Paris Fashion Week shows are a hot mess combination of the sweaty lower levels of a rugby scrum and rarefied, superalist air. It's important to know how to maintain your composure and impeccable style when being pushed around and forced to wait for hours on end. Nicole appears to be a master at safeguarding A-list parameters and status signals in the face of overwhelming challenges. This body language appears to be a matter of subliminal manners, predicated on fashion house rules that may be as intricate as the Da Vinci Code. She went on to say that Salma could have come across as directive or a little superior if she had tried to get Nicole to face the cameras. Nicole seems to shove the hand away, implying that the mime touch violated some sort of silent protocol. Possibly, I'll decide where I move and when I go, she said, reflecting. Looking nonplussed, Salma turns to face Katie again as she returns the kiss. Nicole does seem to point in the direction of what might be a minor flashpoint before turning around. Those who have watched The Devil Wears Prada, however, should be aware that body language at high fashion events may not be appropriate to be evaluated using standard human standards.